Howdy there, folks. This is Luke Charles Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, your little RV specialist. Started by our mom and dad in 1976, we are proud to be a second-generation family-owned and operated business. My friends call me Luke, my sisters call me Charlie, and my 23 nieces and nephews call me Lukey Poo. But you can call me anytime at 440-OHIO-RVs. Again, that's 440-OHIO-RVS. A member of our growing team would be happy to help you. Please check out our website at truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. Again, that's truck and RV. RV.com. There's a direct link to this particular RV in the video description below. If you follow that link, it will take you to our website where you can see pricing and more information on this unit. We will beat or match anyone's pricing on brand new current model year road treks. Give us a call at 440 Ohio RVs. Again, that's 440 OHIO RVS. For sale today, we have a brand new 2023 Road Trek Zion. Alrighty, folks, here we are inside of this brand new 2023 Road Trek Zion. As usual, I'm going to start in the front, work my way towards the rear. I'm going to do my best to give you a good idea of the overall floor plan of this brand new road trek. Here at Coon Truck and RV, we are proud to be a second generation family owned and operated business. We are going to make it worth your trip out here to Sherwood, Ohio for a brand new road trek. Not only do we have unbeatable pricing, we'll beat or match anyone's pricing. We're going to credit the cost of your economy class flight from anywhere in the lower 48 off of the purchase price of your brand new road trek. We're also gonna give you two nights of free camping here in our new campground in Sherwood, Ohio. Gonna go through a full demo with you, answer all your questions, and make sure you are comfortable with your brand new road trek and ready to hit the highway. We've got about 74 inches of headroom in the coach here, about 72 inches at the air conditioner in the back. Got a DC fantastic fan style here in the center of the coach. Air conditioner in the back is controlled through our Firefly system. We got a full video going through all the functionalities of this. We're gonna put a link to that in the video description and on the screen here. I'm gonna go through it real quick. We got our lights and everything that you control through here, including your air conditioner, your furnace, your water heater, your power sofa, your power awning, all that stuff. So everything's going to happen here in the Firefly. We've got our step switch here. This will turn on and off the power toolie step outside of this sliding door. You don't want that to open and close every time you open and close this door. Got our battery disconnect. This will shut off the Firefly system and also disconnect the two 300 amp lithium batteries. So we've got 600 amps of lithium battery. Those have built in battery management systems and built in heaters. Got this nice sliding door here. Got a window that slides over on this portion. We've got this uh, flap here that comes down. This is a screened portion here, and this is a privacy curtain, so you can use whichever you prefer. You can have these deployed and have the doors closed. There's a similar style one in the rear. So again, you can put those down and have the doors closed if you'd like. We've got solid surface countertops. We've got AC power here. Got a USB plug-in in the center and we've got DC power there. Got a counter flip out so you can get more counter space. This is the chestnut interior. So chestnut color cabinets, timeless look. Got AC power down here, got our fire extinguisher. Got a table mount here in the front. Also got one in the rear. The Thule table is in the back door. There's a little storage spot for that. It's got a single basin stainless sink. Got some RV winterization fluid in there. Got a nice tall faucet. Got a two burner propane cooktop. Limited propane in these road treks. We've got our stove top, our water heater, and our furnace that burn propane. Got our aluminum backsplash, microwave. Got the Vitra Frigo refrigerator here. So this is a DC powered compressor driven refrigerator freezer. You got your 600 amps of lithium. We've got 300 watts of solar on the roof. That's going to keep those charged up. Also got an underhood generator that produces 280 amp hours of electricity. Going to keep those lithiums charged up. So you got your underhood generator. Going to run whenever the engine is running. We've got this nice big slide out pantry here. Then we got the solar. We've got the underhood generator. We've got a 3,000 watt sine wave inverter. So that's what's powering everything in this coach that runs on AC when you're running them off your lithium batteries. So like your air conditioner. So you can run your air conditioner on that 3000 watt sine wave inverter off of that nice big lithium power bank. Got our restroom area here, seamless fiberglass enclosure. Got a mirror on the right, a little stash spot for your soaps and our sink. Got our toilet here. This is easily accessible, not much of a step up and in. 
that are drained there in the back. That's where all the water is going to drain when you take a shower. You can pull the curtain around you. If you're in here, you can latch these where they're open more. That's going to give you more elbow room in there. Got nice mirrors here so you can see yourself on the outside. Got a wardrobe here. Table leg, some pillows and extra cushions. I'm going to take a moment here and talk about some of the construction here. So we've got hard surface flooring beneath that. We've got interlocking subflooring. We've got CNC machined cabinetry. We've got laser cut insulation that is then bonded to the walls and ceiling. We've got preformed panels in the ceiling. Those are going to be able to be dropped down if you had to service this and access up there. Also got Wyland wiring harnesses throughout the coach. Those have Wyland connectors. It's going to make everything a lot more consistent as far as the wiring. Road Trek put a lot of time and energy into designing these Road Treks. They're really beautiful vans and have a lot of really great things about them. Got our solar controller there. It's hooked to those 300 watt solar panels. You're going to have 200 watts on these slumber models. AC power on the left, some TV connections and DC power. This Road Trek Zion comes with the optional forward facing sofa. You can push a button on the Firefly or there's a manual button over here. We'll flatten this sofa out and create two twin sleepers. Or you can make one big bed if you fill in the gap here with the extra cushions. You can also get the Zion with two permanent twin sleepers. Got automotive safety glass on these limousine style windows. Got a slider shade there. Another one here. The windows open there on these two rear ones. Got screens you can slide across. So better acoustic insulation, better tint, and overall quality on these nice luxury limousine style windows. Again, got the screens on these two rear ones so you can get a nice cross breeze going. We've got the screen in the rear. This has a privacy option or a screened option. So you can have these doors open and have it where nobody can see in here or you can have it where you can get a nice breeze through here and still keep the bugs out. We've got three belts in the rear. So two shoulder belts, there's a lap belt. Those are down underneath the sofa, so you can push them up through this crack if you want to have them out, or if you don't, push them down. So five total seat belts in this unit. Got a 24-inch smart TV. It's on a swivel mount. Helps you get the perfect position for that. Got reading lights. You can click these on and off right here while you're sitting or sleeping back here. That way you don't have to go through the Firefly. You can also access the Firefly via the app. Got a power station here with AC, USB, and DC plug-in. Got some speakers in the rear. Those connect and will play whatever the driver and passenger are listening to up front. Another power station with AC, DC, and USB. And another power station here with AC, DC, and USB. So lots of places to plug your stuff in here in the rear. Got a manual switch here. You can use that to control the power sofa in the rear. If you don't want to use the Firefly, whether that's through the direct interface or on the app, so I'm going to drop some pictures now of what this bed looks like made up so you can see what that looks like and get some measurements. The rear twin beds measure 75 inches north, south, or front to back and 24 inches east, west, or side to side. The big bed measures 75 inches north, south, or front to back and 68 inches east, west, or side to side. Here we are sitting in the rear of the road trek. What is a tree's favorite drink? Root beer. Got our 3000 watt sine wave inverter in here. It's the back of our water heater. Got a furnace duct, noxious gas detector. Get you a little pan of the RV. Nice and spacious. Lots of storage in the Road Trek Zion. That nice sliding door. Got some storage overhead here. Also got nice storage overhead above the sitting area. Got a fuse panel there. So all in all, we've got super nice road trucks here, brand new units. These are extremely well designed, all in-house R&D by Road Trek. These have fantastic quality control. We are really impressed with just all the thought that went into making the new Road Trek series, all the machine cabinetry, interlocking flooring, 
laser cut insulation. We've actually got all metal hangers for the cabinetry. So all metal cabinet hangers, hard surface flooring, just a lot of uh, thought that went into this coach, preformed ceiling panels. We're gonna make it worth your while to come out here to Sherwood, Ohio. We are going to credit the cost of your economy class flight from anywhere in the lower 48 off of the purchase price of your brand new road trek from Coon Truck and RV. We will beat or match anyone's pricing. We're also going to give you two nights of free camping in our campground here in Sherwood, Ohio. I'm gonna go through a full demo with you, answer any questions you may have, check out our Google reviews, subscribe to our channel. We're gonna make it worth your while here. We're gonna show you the family owned and operated difference here at Coon Truck and RV. So, beautiful units. Subscribe to our channel for more road treks coming soon, pre-owned and brand new. Uh, check us out at truckandrv.com. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976 and home of the RV brothers. Up here in the cabin area, we got power windows, power locks, power mirrors, tilt. We've got storage here and here. Some up top. We've got steering wheel controls for the cruise control, radio, and phone connectivity. So this has got nav, phone connection, all the latest and greatest goodies. You can do the climate control through here. You can do it the more traditional way here with the knobs. Got USB standard and USB-C plugins, so two of each of those. And we've also got a traditional DC plug-in there. This is a wireless charging station. Cup holders here. Nice looking upholstery. The backup camera will function through this screen here and also through your rear view mirror. So really nice comfortable front here with lots of extra amenities. Alrighty folks, we're gonna go around the outside of this brand new 2023 Road Trek Zion. This Road Trek measures 20 feet, nine inches bumper to bumper with a 13 foot power awning. These Road Treks are built on Ram ProMaster 3500 HD RV ready chassis. This particular unit has 27 miles on the odometer. These go through a road test, a leak test, and a humidity test before they leave the factory. This particular road trek is the silver metallic exterior. These have 34 custom painted components on the exterior. This awning end here is one of them. So this 13 foot power awning, the LED porch lights, everything's controlled through the Firefly system, which is right up inside here on the inside of the coach. Got our awning legs run those directly to the ground. You can put a tent stake in them there, or you can run them over to the coach here and put them in these little black clevises. I prefer to have them directly to the ground. If you have them like this, somebody can accidentally walk through here and break those. You've got nice big Thule electric steps. These have a pin override if they get stuck out. These have a nice wide tread. They're low to the ground, so they are nice for kids, pets, or for overall accessibility into the coach here. Just go in and out like that. Got really nice screens on the road trucks. We got one for the side entry and one for the rear door. You can roll these up when you're not using them. Zip these here like a tent and close that off. Got that chestnut interior, very good looking. We've got our propane tank, that's 5.9 gallons. Also got a quick connect for something like a grill that's mounted to the unit, so you'll have to drive this road trek wherever you'd like to fill the propane. We've got luxury limousine windows. So these are automotive glass. These are higher quality, better tint, better performance overall. We've got a TV antenna up top, got our air conditioner here. We've got a really nice backup camera system in this. It will function through the rear view mirror and also through the head unit up front. Got our table there. You can roll this up and buckle it when you're not using it. Got storage space back here. You can use this as a screen. There's also a privacy flap that you can flip up and zip in. You can zip that closed here on the sides to keep bugs out. Got our city water. This is a drain for the fresh water tank. We've got our hitch receiver here. This is a 3,500 pound towing capacity, 300 pound tongue weight. Got our hookups here for whatever you're towing. We've got our TV coax in, got our shore power in. Going around now to the driver's side. 
Got solar panels up top. Got 300 watts of solar on all of the 2023 road treks. We've got 200 watts on the slumber models. The slumber models are the pop tops. We'll have those coming soon. So subscribe to our channel. If you'd like to see those coming soon here. Got our outside shower. It's nice for kids, pets, going to the beach. Keep your mess out of the RV. Got the back of the Truma AquaGo water heater. Got an exhaust here. So this is a unique and well-designed system here. We've got two options for our sewer drains. We've got a gravity feed. We've also got a macerator pump. The macerator pump, you're going to open the black over here first and then the gray. You're going to push a button that is up inside of the driver's door. We'll check out here in a little bit. It will pump everything out of this 11 foot hose. This is a really nice high quality hose that will help keep that from breaking down over time. You can also do this via a traditional gravity system. So you can open the black here. You'll open this gate here on the gravity open. The black will come out here, do the gray to flush it. This is nice so you have a backup if your macerator was to fail just by chance, or if perhaps somebody puts a Barbie doll or a little green army man down the toilet and decides it's time for them to go for a swim, you would have that gravity as a backup. Got those nice Thule steps. That red button there is for the macerator. That is for the fill for the onboard fresh water tank. We've got our fuel fill. This has an under hood generator unit. So generators under the hood, that's gonna run when the engine is on. That is a 280 amp hour generator unit. Nice and quiet, has lower emissions than a traditional generator. Super cool road treks. These are very well designed, all in-house research and development. Check these out at truckandrv.com. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976 and home of the RV Brothers.